All right, what is up, YouTube? Today, we will be playing a deck that somebody had requested, Billy Williams had requested. Um, he has shown me this Pojo thread, or sent me the link, or commented the link, however you want to say it, to the 12th place Michigan Garden City Regionals Assure News. Now, the extra deck, I know you was like, why does it look like that? The extra deck looks like this because I, he only mentions these. I mean, these are the only, what, uh, what is it, three, seven. There's only nine cards that he mentioned in his uh what's name in his little uh his little description of how the event went he didn't give like he didn't give a um a extra deck um he didn't put his extra deck down he only gave us the main deck list and then he told us about his matches which he only pretty much revealed that these are the cards that he played so no i do not know if he did play any of these cards i don't know if that was in his extra i do not know the final six cards in his extra deck so i just put these as generic because i mean i you're playing level four so i'm guessing you're running dweller uh he never said nothing about utopia so he, he could be playing that um he's also playing terror top so i'm believing he's playing levier to use with um the gold sarks and you know shit that gets banished scarlight i mean it's generic level eight Beals is good void is good um i do not know if he played this like i said these last six i don't know if he played but yeah i'm gonna put the link down in the description so you guys can go check it out maybe you guys can get an answer from him or something uh to ask him what his extra deck is so like i said um do not take this as a statement this is not his full deck list this is all that i if like i said these only nine that i do know that he did play so like I said, I'm going to leave a link in the description so you guys can see for yourself. So, you know, without further ado, we're going to try this out um, and see what we can do with this and see, you know, why he likes it so much. I like his text. Galaxy Cyclone is getting, Cosmic Cyclone is getting better and better um, as the format goes on. So if you guys can find these for cheap, definitely pick them up. This card may spike. Uh, may spike definitely flood a trap hole that also may spike because this card is once again getting better and better as the format goes on and um <clears throat> yeah so uh he's using book of moon which i love <laughs> which is just amazing i love book of moon right now um i'd rather play book of eclipse but book of moon is still you know it's just as good um <clears throat> uh so yeah that is pretty much it with the text. I mean, Ghost Ogres, they're they're very good too. Definitely pick some up if you're you don't already got those. I told you guys about that in like July or something. Definitely pick up some Ghost Ogres Snow Rabbit because these are gonna be these th these are good. Not gonna be good, but these are good. But like I said, definitely Cosmic Cyclone and Flug A Trap Over. If you can find those for cheap, definitely pick up a, a play set of each because I see those cards going up in the near future. But without further ado, let's but let's get straight into the video. But I mean, straight into the dueling, but before we get into that, I would like to say if you guys do enjoy this video, definitely leave a like. Um, shout outs to, uh, I don't know his name. Shout outs to him, whoever uh, whoever he is. Shout outs to him for getting 12th place and whatnot. Also, comment, let me know what you think of this deck, what you think of his regional thing, his report and stuff, and what do you think about these cards like Cosmic Cyclone and Floodgate and stuff like that in this deck. Also, subscribe if you have not. Uh, I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 1 p.m. So yeah, you're definitely getting three to, three videos a week. So definitely subscribe for that if you do enjoy zombies and stuff. Um, also, if you can, click add to help support the channel. We'd be very appreciative. So without further ado, let's save it. Shuffle it a couple of times. Let's see what we open up with. Nah, not the best hand. Not the best hand. We can protect ourselves with Trick Clown and this. Um, and then like if we draw the Soul Charge. We can just detach it. I mean, discard it with this, and then we can get our plays going. So let's go ahead and press save, and we'll be right back. All right, so we are in our first duel today against Ice Water. I'm surprised I said that right the first time. Oh, he actually went paper. We're definitely going to go first. He's only playing five extra deck cards. And look what we have opened. We have opened up Terra Top, Ghost Ogre. Part of this hand is just fucking fan fucking tastic. Um,. Probably he might be playing Dante. I don't know. He might be playing that too. That 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 is a uh, that is something he might be playing. So, man, I I really like this card. I really do like Terra Top. I like the fact that you can, what's the name? You can just um you can just special summon it and pretty much it's just a free it's just a free monster and it, it baits out back and stuff. Surprisingly, he does not play Twin Twister. So um. I mean, there's nothing really he can do now. So we're going to just go strike the, uh, 
go start to sage um go into a levier so i'm hoping he plays levier but like i said um he doesn't play twin twister which i do not agree with because i hate going against back row i just fucking lose when i like whenever it's a back row deck i mean i can't if i can't get nothing going like they max see me and shit like that i just can't get i need to get rid of back row and um it does ditch it does ditch a card at your hand which can be also be helpful but like i said i mean not like I said, but I play like Goblin. I play like Goblin Zombie and shit like that. Shit that works in the grave, really. You know, a lot of people don't just. They just play like the generic, like you know, just a regular card. Um, I mean, it's where it's working for him. So I can't, I can't say that it's not, it's not, you know, the best. I can't say that it's, you know, it's not working because it is working. Pot of Desires and Omega is just, it's just so unfair. And we draw into, oh god, that's pretty okay. Let's see what we banished. Ooh, fuck. We hit some we hit some shit. Oh fuck. Um no more Unizombies. Um there's only one Mizuki left. Uh fuck. We hit a lot of good we lit a lot of good shit, but you know what? We got this floodgate trap all, so we should be good. We should be good. We have a ghost hogger for defense. We have a floodgate trap all for going against pendulums. We're gonna return the bandit, the one that's face down. We're gonna return that. Um, we also have Levy here to get shit back. We also have the snow for defense. So I believe we're good. We should be good. We should be good. I mean, he only has five cards in his extra deck, so I don't know what he's playing. Um, but like I said, man, the Flagate Trapo definitely, definitely picks. I'm definitely gonna try to get some this weekend, upcoming weekend. If I do go to locals, hopefully I do. Definitely gonna pick up some of these because this card right here is just, it's just, it's really, I really, it's really good. Um, well, we're gonna just activate Omega. If that's if that's how you want to play it, if that's how you want to play it. We're, okay, so it looks like we're going up against one of those Trito decks. And like I said, this is just a easy out to that. We drew Brilliant Fusion, but I'm pretty sure yeah, we we still have enough. No, we don't. Why not? Um, one go. Oh fuck, we drew everything. Uh, everything got banished or something. So what we're going to do is just um. Maybe we could just go Dweller. Like, it doesn't really matter. Uh, he said Moonlight was really good for him. Um, Clearwing is actually is, is really good also because it, it, it stops Busters in his tracks. I mean, they can just attack over it. But if you got backward on shit, then that pretty much uh, solves the little Buster problem. Um, let me just do this. Huh? Let me just get this Mizuki back. Oh, we can go Dweller. I think I want to put this in a grave. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go Dweller because it looks like he's playing... Um, he is playing uh, the Trito deck. I believe the Trito needs these cards. So, I mean, we're, we have Double Omega, Dweller. Uh, we can set this as Bluff. So yeah, this is looking pretty good. Um, like worst comes to worst, we have a fairy tale snow. So now the question is, do we want to attack with something under than two thousand? Because you know, Duperog does have two thousand defense. So I don't know. Not you know, he's going to attack with the highest first. Because you never know what we might be playing. Never know what we really might be playing. Uh, he may be playing Gores. He may be playing some weird shit like that. This may be a fossil dino. And what does this do? Nothing. We're actually playing Ice Rares. So that's that's some shit. It has 16 D. So I mean, this would have got over it. Actually, we could have actually got game. Could have just attached this. And, yeah, we could have got game. But you know what, we're gonna just take our time. Wait a minute, we don't even have, we don't even have another Mizuki in the deck. I just noticed that. So what we're gonna do is just discard from the hand. I, I was gonna fuck up and literally do it from the deck. But like I said, man, this this deck is already starting off good, but you know, we're not getting against the best competition, but hey, I'm not gonna complain. Um Get this out. And you know what? I think I'm going to send... What's his name? 
Wait, hold on. How many chief priests we have? I only have one left. I, think I want to send it. Uh, he, he, there's no possible way he's going to have anything that's worthwhile to do. I mean, the worst comes to worst, we could just return it with Omega. I think that's just what we're going to do. Probably going to do that. Probably going to just return uh, Spirit Master with Omega. And then that'll just pretty much be it. No, we don't. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Draw, draw phase. We do want to use this. Do want to use this. Don't need the chain. Sadly, if we put on ignore chain, they won't let us use our Omegas. Uh, we already know about those. We can put this back. I'm just saying, just in case, worst case, worst case fucking scenario, we need that in the graveyard. Uh, nothing else really needs to be back in the grave. So we're just going to put one of these Mizukis back. Like I said, worst come to worst, we have to use that. <laughs> Doesn't look like we're going to have to. Like I said, man. Uh, yeah, see, this is just over. This is just completely over. We're playing against a 50... The 52 card deck, fucking. I mean, yeah, that that does look like a very fucking bad hand. Um, playing against ice bears. Um, I don't know why I drew the one tech book of moon. Ah, fuck. Ah, oh, damn. Just clear bullshit. That's just <laughs> clear bullshit. I mean. Well, at least we all know we won the game, so there's nothing. You're going to do the same thing? No, I was about to say. It was funny. Well, that, that that probably should have been a fuck. The one Garnet, right? I don't think he only plays one. Uh, Yeah, we're going to have to do that. Actually, can we make two? Oh, we can make two Omegas. I completely keep forgetting that we can make double Omega. I really do. Oh shit, almost fucked up. Uh, this should be two. Yeah, what what am I even worrying about? This is two Omegas. Uh, sadly, Death Pro, for some fucking reason, I guess, doesn't like me, like people to have two. I don't even know what to do. I can't even, I don't know which one to press. Like, I, I go to the actual one, and then it's still the same shit. It's still the same shit. Like, it's just... I don't even want to go double Omega because I know what the fuck is going to happen. I really don't. Um, let's just do you just in case something happens. But man, this is this is ridiculous. This is just fucking ridiculous, man. We're just it's getting to a point where it's just like, damn. Does it, is it is it necessary? Is it necessary for it to have to Omega not to work? There's no reason. Um, but, uh, yeah, <clears throat> so back to this deck, clear wing, uh, I mean, now that I think about it, it is looking better and better. Uh, I mean, against ABCs, it's very, very good. Probably should just want to replace it. It's probably would have been a better, would have been a better choice to go replace it. But, um... You can't go wrong with Double Omega. I, I just have bad luck with Double Omega. It just never works for me. So you know what we're going to do? We're not. I don't even think I'm going to banish the second Omega unless I have to. Unless I like forced to banish both Omegas. I'm going to just keep one on the field just so we won't, it won't fucking glitch out. And we will just be able to play. Because this is ridiculous. Like I have advantage of the duel. Okay, yeah, we're going to just going to use one. I'm just going to ignore chain because I don't even care anymore. If you want to ignore chain, we should just get the Omega back. Cool. Thank you. Let's go. All right. So, can't activate this because we only played one. Uh, hmm. I could just normal summon this. What the fuck? Oh, that must be the red eyes card, huh? We can beat him. So we're gonna just put ignore chain. If this is the red eyes card, we win. If that's the little black fucking, 
I forgot what it's called. Not the white, not the ancient stone. I'm just, it's the, uh, just like a regular one. I can distribute this, can I? Yeah, I can. Distribute this, get the, oh, oh, fuck. I really thought I had all three unit zombies, but I was like, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't be able to activate it if I didn't have it. Um, we can gamble with the 13. But it would still be game without the 13? That's 56 and 26. I mean, yeah, it'll, it'll still be game. Why should be the fucking Keeper of the Dragon? 2100 fucking defense. Am I right? Okay, yeah, there's Black Metal Dragon. That's what the fuck. I knew it. Yeah, it had to be this because that's the only one that activates. We don't care, young man. We don't care. Hopefully this man does not play anything specifically good. I'm talking about like a Gores or like a Trag or something. Because that's uh Nobody's expecting those cards. So, I wouldn't be surprised if somebody actually went... Actually, is this game? 26 and 50. That is game. I keep thinking... Oh, my God. Math is terrible. This is 56. And that's uh, 8,200 that I'm about to do. So, yeah. That is the uh, OTK. Turn 3. Turn 3 OTK. So... That is good. We're doing pretty good. Didn't have to use both Omegas. Uh, not the best of challenges. But uh, you know what? I can't complain. This is this is Dev Pro's random. I'm not picking. Well, I am picking my opponents, but I'm not picking. You know, I don't I don't know what they're playing. So, I... All right. So we're on to the third duel. Hopefully, we can do something. It looks like this is going to be back to the same exact thing. Same exact thing. Both all three games. This is rock, then this is scissors, then it's a paper. And we have opened up fantastic fucking hand because what we can do is we can tear a top fuck this is this is ridiculous we can tear a top right i'm just gonna do it i'm just gonna do the whole play we're gonna just put ignore chain on because i don't want to keep asking me this is going to be a ridiculous play we're going to get we're going to be able to go with flagia double omega i think I think this is Reflasia Double Omega. If I'm not certain, this is Reflasia Double Omega. Possibly even triple. No, no. Let me stop going too far. Um, wait, can it be? It may. I can. I, no, not triple Omega, but I can go. I can. Huh? I'm guaranteed two. Let's see, because this is Levier. We can do you. That gets banished, right? Gets you. Actually, we could just end up with a Clear Wing or a Moonlight, which I just think is. Fan. Okay, so yeah, we can end up. Ah, uh, fuck! Why didn't let me play, bro? Um, I could send Mizuki. Levier, I can then go, bam, we'll go to a level 8, Mizuki this, ditch, make it, make it level 4, Levier, Levier get back to Mizuki, sink again, go into another level 8, so it's Levier, double Omega, then I can Mizuki for, I can actually instant fusion, get back the... Fuck. Like this and just go clear wing or something. Eh. Or I can just, you know, Mizuki this and leave that. Eh, there's a lot of plays I can do. That's pretty good. So, yeah, that was a pretty good opening. Okay, so I'm pretty sure you're going to go rock. Why did I pick scissors? Oh, you actually went rock. That was stupid. Uh, let's go ahead and go first. We still haven't got max seed yet, which is this is fucking awful. Oh, well, it's pot. Hopefully, we don't get something terrible. Oh, fuck. Jesus. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's all good. Ooh, one brilliant fusion left. Oh, my God. One trap left. This is awful. Um, <laughs> wow. Uh, that was an ass. That was really ass. Um, I guess I could set this. Is this what I think it is? 
Well, sure, I don't know. What do you think it is, Dragon Dragon 11551? Well, at least I have a Ghost Circuit, which I can only use once per turn. But if worse comes to worse, it is a tuner. Holy fuck. This is going to be cool because I know what he's going to do. Never mind. I thought he was going to go into that one. Remember that OTK that they had, uh, the, the, the Red Eyes? I'm pretty sure he has to have fucking, what's the name? There's no way you do this. Okay, it just has to be that card. It has to be that deck. Um, it's where, uh, it's a, there's the new one that came out in Vengeance. You burn, you burn for, uh, you burn for life. And then you just activate the Inferno Fire Blast, and then you go, uh, you, um, what do you, fuck, man, why do they not play, I don't get why y'all don't play Black Rose, it's just really, it's really a fucking, ama there it goes, okay, so he does, he does have it, he's gonna be, use this, and then Serial Spell, um, actually he's gonna, okay, no, no, he's gonna, fuck, piece of shit. What do you do? You don't do anything. Well, I lost. Yep, this looks like I lost. Don't understand why he just didn't do the other one. Did he draw three? Can you not attack or something? Oh, I'm not. I'm not familiar. Why would he? Why would he not attack? So I can moonlight. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Why did I fucking do that? Get this gold sark cheap freeze and pop it. I should have known something this and went dweller. Well, this is going to suck. Hmm. Go shark chief fees. I mean chief priest, not chief chief. <laughs> uh, so we can go shark uh, chief chief priest. Well, I mean spirit master. Pop this. He's going to get another insight. Then he's going to have the red. What's the name? Where I can just. I mean, where I can just moonlight rose it. I want some damage. That's what the fuck I want. I really want damage right now. I want damage. That's fine. You're going to activate. Can't I ghost over that? Does that not activate? Okay, what do you do? Um, what's it say? This card in your possession is destroyed by a card effect. It's just a graveyard. You can target one red eyes. You monster. Ooh, don't tell me we banished both chief priests. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Okay, here we go. We didn't do it. All right, bam. I'm gonna pop you. This doesn't do nothing, right? This is going to add the Western name. That's completely fine. What do you do? Um, you just do this. Proceed to go into a moonlight, right? Moonlight popped that back to his hand. Don't want to use Trick Clown. Oh, we don't want to use that either. Then we want to use said instant fusion to get this this oh, that just needs a red eyes monster um see now we can go uh actually we don't even have enough we don't even have a i know we do have one floodgate left that'd be terrible so instead we're gonna just go to clear wing because if he tries to get cute we can just negate shit and this is 4900 so all in all Probably should have just went Dweller. But then that would have been kind of ass. Come to think about it, it kind of would have been ass. Nice play. Cool. Thank you. Appreciate it. So now, when he... Wait, what did he search? Did he, did he search the spell? He did. He, he searched Red Eyes Fusion. Okay. Well, I, just, I gave him back that, so it doesn't really matter. I don't understand why he would you ditch that. Can you even still use Red Eyes Fusion? Okay, but then yeah, I win now. Because what? Can I normal summon special summon other monsters to turn you activate this effect? So you're going to special, and then this is going to activate popping that back to your hand. What would it say? Flick damage. Okay, wait. If this card is fusion summon, 
You can send one red ice from hand or deck if you do inflict damage equal to has that attack. Okay, well I'm just gonna do that. And negate it. And since you can't special summon, that won't work because it's not on the field. Because you can't do the uh the attack. Because it says half the what oh wait, never mind. Half the original attack of that monster, so I would have lost. So look at that. Moonlight and Crystal Wing Clear Wing. Just look at that combination. Even though I would have preferred Black Rose. GG to you two, Dragon 11, 551. Five, that was pretty good. Um, how long was that? 20 something, 25 minutes? Huh? This, yeah, that's a good part to end it on. But you know what? No, I need my ass whipped. I need my ass whipped. That was really a good duel. Um, but I need my ass whipped. I need to play against ABCs. I need to see what this deck can do against the meta. Let me get one more duel or just anything. I just want my ass whooped. Be right All right, so. The final duel of the day against Revive Kusari. And we have won again. 40 cards, 15 extra. That is fine. We open up Ghost Sark and we open up. See, this is why. You know what? We're going to start the game off with a Moonlight Rose. I think that's what we want to do. This is, you know, this is why I play the two star. That's exactly why I play the two star. I'm gonna do you. I'm gonna do you. Really wish this just was any fucking zero defense zombie. That would just be fucking fantastic. It would be fantastic. This is not the best play because now we only have one unit zombie left. So this is not gonna bode well if this goes any longer. But Moonlight Rose is. Black Moonlight Dragon is it, it's pretty good. But uh, hold on real quick because I have to go do something. Uh, be right back. All right, so I am back. We have Defense up to Wahoo. We have Moonlight Dragon that can activate. We have a Ghost Stalker that can activate. Hopefully, you know, we get our asses kicked. Hold on real quick. Never mind. It doesn't look like we're going to get our ass. Ooh, and we have drawn the Vanities, which is, which is beautiful. Which is just fucking beautiful. Um... Just do this. Really want a teraton. Oh fuck. So wait. Would this trigger? Would this, this wouldn't trigger, would it? No, it's face down. Fuck. So you know that's part of taboos. So we're going to set this. This is a Regeki return. Then it looks at my hand. Probably should have went Chris. No, I mean, I mean, there's no way we're, we're predicting princess. I mean, predict. Look at that. Look at that play on words. There's no way we're going to predict prediction princesses. So I'm not going to trip. He's probably going to Regeki. If I'm not mistaken. No, draw two cards. No, I guess we'll do this. I guess we'll do this. You know what? Because he is drawing two cards. So, Book of Eclipse. This is still going to kill your monster. I don't. I didn't understand that whole thing right there. But it's still going to kill your monster, sir. It's not specific to um, a face up. It just says destroy that card, right? Yeah. See if it if it said something different. Like, um, uh, I don't know. There's like, it, it's, it's just depending on the wording of the card. If it said something completely different, that is a pretty good card to draw. Brilliant Fusion. Fuck, we drew another one of these. So, oh, fuck, I don't even know really what to do. Why am I sitting here waiting this whole fucking time? Should I attack? No, I'm not gonna attack. I, I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand myself. I completely forget that this man plays samurai. This is the easiest shit. Like, really? I'm sitting here waiting to draw a fucking tuner, and I have a tuner. So that's what we're going to do. Since it's, you know we're playing against Prediction Princess, hopefully he does not uh, use the one card known as Book of Eclipse against me. It's our last unit zombie, but you know what? It doesn't really matter because worst case, 
scenario, you could go start Kashir new and get this back out. And I think that might that might be something we do. That really might be something we do. That's why Ghost Arc is just amazing. So let's definitely not get units on we because that's not gonna do anything. Actually, we can target this and ditch this. Hmm. We can, but we're not. We're gonna just go Omega. We're gonna take it to slow bro. We're gonna take the slow bro. Like I said, man, we got Moonlight, we got a ghost ogre, we got vanities, which is just amazing. We're gonna we're gonna take we're gonna take it slow. Because if he does have another flip, this is we're gonna have to uh we're gonna have to give him the cheese. Let's go ahead and we just return this. And uh, we're going to put on always chain. So it looks like, oh, oh no, we, we can't have this that duel going over 80,000 minutes. And this is what it's looking like. So probably should have been on an aggressive mode. Sadly, we don't have black rose because I would have fucking rose the board. Like it was nothing in go start. There we go. There we go. Wait, wait, what does it say? Can I activate monster effects for the rest of the turn? So we're going to do this. And hopefully that pretty much wrecks him because uh, he can't activate no more. There we go. All right. So that's the end of that duel. Um, uh, I would get another duel, but it's going to just keep stretching the video longer and longer. Sadly, we did not get our acid kick today or, you know, a very, we did have one good match where, you know, it was a little back and forth. So that's pretty good. But all in all, this deck went 4-0, I, I believe. It went 4-0 today, so that's good. So, yeah, um, <clears throat> I'm liking the deck. I like the defensive measures that it goes or does it as it has. Uh, the Ghost Ogres are, just, I mean, brilliant. Um, the, the Moonlights, the Ghost Sharks. I mean, all this is just really good. So I can see how he uh, how he did pretty good at a regional. Like I said, this defense... The defense that this deck has is just brilliant. Um, the Potter Desires gives you extra draw power. Ghost Ogres are just, I mean, we drew them every fucking game pretty much. Uh, they're just added protection. Moonlight is just, it's fans fucking tastic. I, I got to pick him up in one of these. They're like four or five dollars, so it's not really too much. Um, so yeah, definitely want to pick these up before they go up. Yeah, and Clear Wing is, you know, still good. Uh, sadly, we did not go against a meta deck. Sadly, but you know what? We can't control that. You know, we did get a couple of good duels, but yeah, so that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching. Um, like, like the video if you do enjoy it. I mean, uh, comment, let me know uh, what you think of the deck, uh, what changes I should make, or any suggestions you do have for me to uh, uh, any suggestions of decks you guys would like to see me play and give my little, you know, opinion on it and whatnot. Um, also subscribe if you have not I upload Monday Wednesday and Friday if you did not hear me at the beginning of the video or you skipped over that whole beginning of the video um, whatever uh, whatever you did um, if you just couldn't hear it at the time I upload Monday Wednesday Friday at 1 p.m. on the dot uh, so you get three videos a week so definitely subscribe for that if you're just looking for just a generic um, YouTube I mean not generic YouTube I'm saying like if you just look for a duel you know every couple of days or whatnot uh, definitely subscribe to the channel. If you do enjoy zombies, definitely subscribe to this channel. Um, also, click an ad to help support the channel would be very, very, very helpful to me and for the channel because I do want to do bigger and better stuff. So, hopefully, um, my, my friend did uh, complete his deck. So, um, working on a camera thing, but I'm, I'm gonna try to do something. I mean, I know, I know, I know. I always say it. Nothing ever happens, but hey, I'm gonna try. Um, also, when I go to locals, if I go to locals this week, I'm gonna get some packs. I mean, that's what I've been doing these last couple of um, last couple of locals I've been through. I've just been buying packs, and actually, it's it's actually been working out pretty good. Like I said, um, couple couple weeks ago, I did pull the desires. Um, this time I was buying um, uh, what is they called high speed riders? Hold on, let me see. Um, yeah, high speed riders. The pack with Omega in it. Um, I literally bought what eight packs. And then my friend bought four and he pulled the Omega. I'm like, fuck. Like, <laughs> that shit just hurts so bad. But you know what? Uh, yeah. So, I mean, the, like I said, I've been buying packs. So, uh, next is, uh, what's the name? Leave a suggestion of what pack I should buy. And I'll just open it up. Do like a little separate video. Probably uh, do a little pack opening before the video. And then I get into the video, which is Monday's video. So, which would be another Road to Weiss against Anaheim. Um, I believe number four. I believe number four. So, yeah. Um, I'm rambling too much, so yeah. Ho hope you guys enjoy your weekend. Um, if you go to locals, hope you do well. 
and whatnot. So yeah, I'll see you guys on Monday with another Road to YCS Anaheim. And I'm